Welcome to the Crazy Down Podcast. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Don. I'm Mike the Explosive One. Let's crack into another one. TNT. Yo. One of your favorites said bye 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 to his freedom this weekend. What's that mean, Jonas? What are you talking about? I know you love the Backstreet Boys. Oh man. Okay. All right. Where are we going with this? One of, one of your favorite homies. He got he 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 decided he wanted to drive and kill a man. It wasn't Brian, was it? Who the f- is that? I don't even know. From the Backstreet Boys. Justin Timberlake. It wasn't AJ, was it? Justin from T- the Backstreet Boys. Yeah. Was he in NSYNC? He was. Good. You're a terrible I'm a person. Ter- You're a terrible person. Oh, my God. That's bad. Does that hurt you? When Whoa, I- that's bad. Does that hurt you? Well, it's, it's bad it's that I don't bad. know what boy that's band. That's bad, brother. It's boy band. I don't that's know- bad. That I don't know what boy band he was in? Yeah, I'm surprised you didn't say Joey Fatone. What? Is that's he- 98 Degrees. I'm absolutely- Isn't Joey Fatone from NSYNC? He's from 98 Degrees. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, your homie, sure. your homie. Oh, oh man. Yeah, so JT from NSYNC. He, he was bringing sexy back from NSYNC. Yeah, from, from NSYNC. Yeah. Yeah, he decided that he wanted to go out, and get drunk, and drive home. And guess what? He got caught. Don't do it. Even JT <laughs> going to jail. Look, the pig got up when I said it. that. He got caught. Don't do it. Yeah, and I guess the cops didn't even know who he was. How'd that feel? He oh, gets, yeah. He yeah. gets a Dewey okay. and he ain't even recognized. So apparently the cock was. The, the cock was. Freudian. <laughs> Freud. Say that one more time is what? I don't know if I want to continue the sentence anymore. <laughs> I kind of want to let it breathe for a little bit and then actually say the sentence because if I had actually gotten the sentence out, it would have been crazy. It would have been a crazy sentence. <laughs> okay, Tell I'm, go- more about I'm going cop. to attempt the sentence again now. <laughs> okay. Okay. Reset. The cop was so young. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? That's a Freudian. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. That would have been crazy. The cop sentence. was so young he didn't know who he was. Yeah, so the cop was so young that he didn't even realize who uh, Justin Timberlake was. That's hilarious. Yeah, and it is kind of crazy. And apparently the cop was like, uh, uh, Justin Timberlake at one point said, uh, oh no, the tour's ruined. And the cop was like, what tour? And, he, and Justin Timberlake said, the world tour. And I'm like, Shut the fuck up, The world the tour. The world tour. Because he's on a world tour right now. And honestly, Justin Timberlake, national treasure. Honestly. Is he? 100%, man. 2020 was an amaz- amazing album. He started with NSYNC. He went solo. He did the, tem- the uh, Timberland thing. Amazing time in music history and amazing uh, times in music history as an adult when he came out with the 2020. 2020 was a good album. Don't I have no me, idea. You, yeah, you didn't listen to it. No, all I know is bringing sexy back. Yeah, and that was that's uh, that's the Timberland time. Oh, wait, no, in the uh, don't be so quick to walk away that song. Yeah, that's a good that's see. And like I said, everybody has a song that they know from Justin Timberlake. It's very funny because footage of him actually uh, at the, I think it was MTV Awards or Nickelodeon Awards. I think it was MTV Music Awards. There's actually footage of him telling uh, Britney I, Britney Spears to stop drinking. Like, you know who you are. Stop, stop drinking. drinking. You're getting sloppy. Yeah. And everyone was like, ew, that was cringe as F. I mean, how else? Do you, it's it's weird to tell. Like that's, that's your that's your platform, the Grammys. He didn't say anybody's name. But why would you preach at the uh, Grammys? You, it's like Will Smith being like, "Take keep the, my wife's name out your mouth." Why would you preach at the Grammys? I don't know. It, it, you can call it preaching. I call it putting a message out there in the universe. And if you if it resonates with you, it resonates with He's you. He's just like you know who you are. You sloppy. Yeah. And then I, you're like you're sitting there with a forty and a straw, and you're just like. <laughs> like, uh, like honestly, it's like one of those things. Like right now, if I were to just say, "Hey, look at home right now," if you're listening to this, you don't need that stuff anymore. You don't need that drug. Yeah, you put can that do down. Be- Look yourself in the mirror. Pick yourself up. Get your shit together and get your life moving. Now, look. If I say that, am I preaching? Yeah. Or necessarily am I saying it's like if this resonates with a person, it resonates. And if it makes you a preachy person, then I say everybody needs to preach You don't need that inside of you. 
take it out of you right now. I don't know what that even means. <laughs> Jonas, what do you mean? Anyways, what, what do you mean they by said that? that he told the cop he had one martini. What kind of what kind of person's story going to be like, yeah, I had one martini? You look like a pretentious asshole. You can't... <laughs> <laughs> I'm just... Jonas is concerned about the after. Why couldn't he just said I had a beer? He had to be like, no, officer, I only had one martini. He's like, get the hell out of here with your goddamn dry martini. I mean, ass. He, I, you honestly, gonna imbibe it? It's bro? very funny because I don't think he's lying because he said that. <laughs> I don't know. Either way, I, I'm like, why would you tell a cop that you had anything to drink? Just say no, officer. As soon as you say you've had a drink, they're going to be like, hey, we're going to take you in. They said he smelled like a goddamn bum. Well, then he didn't just have one martini. I know. They they, the, they said that uh, people were saying that he was drinking people's drinks there. He was like pulling a Pam Beasley. <laughs> he was drinking people's drinks? <laughs> he was pulling a Pam Beasley what in the Chile. What hell? Like somebody walked away and he just like throated their drink. Good for him, man. No, because he got in the car. He knows better. He's I mean, rich. that's crazy. He should take a goddamn Uber. Uh, Why do yeah. these rich folks drive themselves around anywhere? Because they can they can get away. With it. I mean, look, honestly, if you're rich and you have a show for all the time, sometimes you're like, yo, I just want to drive again. Yeah, now that you're drunk, drive to goddamn Golden Dawn. I'll give you that, but then you're like, oh, so what? I'm drunk. What are they going to do? Give me a DUI? I'll pay it. I'm rich. Yeah, but now his world, his world tour is ruined. Yeah, I mean, yeah, the, world, the world tour is effed. The world yeah. tour is over. Yeah, they ain't even going to let him in Germany now. I wouldn't let him in my world. I'm not even letting him in my apartment. I didn't even know what goddamn boy band he was in. Uh, that is very obvious, Jonas. With I'm, I don't even re- want to return to that because I fear I might jump over the couch and attack you. Because I disrespected your favorite boy band? I was a big Backstreet Boys fan in my day, Jonas, you know? I love. I like the Backstreet Boys, and Bye 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 was the antithesis to that. Yeah. So was that your anthem? It was the anti Backstreet because an- they were in contention. They for were in what? contention. In contention for what? For the number one spot of the- best back best boy band. Best Jonas. boy band ever. Everybody Outside was like, "Are you on Menudo? the Backstreet Boys side? Or are you on NSYNC side?" What about Menudo? What about the Jackson Five? Who the fuck is Menudo? It's nobody rich. cares about Menudo. I'm not a lot Spanish. Of care about, nobody. No, wow. I'm not Spanish. I don't care about Menudo. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. wow. You care about the Jackson Five? Wow. No. Yeah, I've heard about the Jackson I've Five. Why are we? Why are we? Them. I've heard about the Jackson Five, but they were before. They, I'm like, that's like 40 years before you my. You care existence. about new kids? That's 20 years before NSYNC and Backstreet Boys. What are you talking about right now? O Town. Now, uh, that was the same time period, and they did not gain attraction. I like that you're bringing that up. How about two? Degrees. How about together? You remember the MTV version of a boy band where they like got a bunch of like I don't know. Improv- was, it, was that the one Puff that Daddy did? No, that's uh, making the band. That was Danity Kane. Um, but anyway, I don't know why I know God that. Goddamn! <laughs> but together was the parody, the back, uh, the uh, boy band parody that MTV did, and they had a song that was a. Uh, Oh man, you plus me makes chemistry. How did it go, dude? I don't know. How did the together song go, Jonas? Do you remember? No. Hold on, let me look it up, Jonas. Just real quick. I just want to see. Uh, it was MTV I- together. Boy band, right there. Yeah. Let's see if you remember. Do you remember this? No. No, you plus what does that say? You plus me equals us, calculus. <laughs> you plus me equals us, I know my calculus. You don't remember this? No. This is, this is doing nothing for <laughs> Oh, my God. So it was like a parody boy band, Jonas. Oh, wow. It okay. was bad, dude. They have like a, they have like a heavy set overweight. Uh, I shouldn't say heavy set overweight. I should say like a heavy set uh, like middle-aged guy in, in, the, in the group as well. Okay. It was cool. It was, cool. It was a cool time in history, boy okay. band history. Well, you know what the moral of the story is? Don't, don't. get drunk and drive. Yeah, don't, don't drink and drunk. drive. Yeah, the fuck. And don't be in a boy band. I mean, in 2001, it would have been a good idea. Not now. You wouldn't do a boy band with me? Would you be in a boy band with yeah, me? Yeah, absolutely. I'll be the white guy. Uh, look, just, what does that mean? <laughs> if you're the white guy, then I'm the black guy. Right, so we need we need a different, bunch of other diversity. We don't we get... need any more diversity. I think we have a pretty good swap. You can't have a boy band with two or a duo, then. You need a boy we band. We could be like Jodeci. 
Casey and JoJo is not Jodeci. Jodeci had you? more than just them two. We could break off and be Casey and JoJo, but we got to have the boy band first. What two syllable name with two vowels are you going to be? Well, if you could be TNT and JoJo. <laughs> oh, but I have to spell it. I'll have to. I could spell it TT. Maybe. <laughs> T T T. <laughs> you could be JoJo. Jesus Christ. That's all the time we have for today's episode. Go to thecrazynown.com for Jonas. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here too. I don't know. Whatever. Dude. TNT, we out. Whatever. I'm here.